What is going on guys? Today we are out here in the back country of the Florida Keys. Don't have the boat today. We're just doing it solo today. Biked back into a very far back trail. Biked about five miles to get back here. We are going to see if there's any baby tarpon stacked up in here. Normally during the winter time, these baby tarpon like to stack up in these creeks way, way far back, as far back as they can push. So we're gonna go back there and uh, throw around some Monster 3X, little fluke style baits, maybe the, the X swim and the, and the J strike. And we'll see, uh, we'll see if we can find any baby tarpon. Hopefully we will. Stay tuned, let's do it. Alright guys, well, I don't know if you see these little bubbles, but I just got smashed by a tarpon right here at my feet. I mean, he came up and just clobbered this little swim bait. All right, you guys, put on that little shrimp imitation. That's finally all it took to get one. Had one hit the swim bait, cast it at a few other rollers, they wouldn't eat it. Put on this 3X shrimp as soon as I threw it out, this guy crushed it. Oh, awesome jump. Beautiful. All it took was putting on that little shrimp imitation. Literally, cast it on a roller, popped it two times, and he slammed it. That was epic. Don't know how he's hooked though, so we'll see about the landing part here. Ooh, angry little fish. There was a crocodile around too, so I gotta be kind of careful. I did just see a croc. Man, he's angry. He's a healthy little guy, spunky in the cold water. Oh my God, he's angry. Come on, there we go, got him. Landed him, beautiful fish. Yeah, he got hooked right in the side of the head, so funny. Look at that, that Monster 3X right there where it's supposed to be. All right, beautiful, perfect Florida Keys baby tarp in the backcountry. Whoop, there he goes. Oh, yes. All right, there we go, guys, mission accomplished. I was seeing a bunch of tarp and roll, so what I actually did is I rigged up that little 3X shrimp, this guy right here, on the weedless hook right there, in an eighth ounce just to keep it on the surface, and I just saw that guy roll, slow move that shrimp right over his head, and he absolutely crushed it. But um, that was a beautiful fish, man. That's exactly what we were looking for out here. Juvenile tarpon. So there we go, mission accomplished. That was the uh, wintertime baby tarpon. I was hoping to find some back here. I was actually seeing a bunch roll around, but as soon as I kind of walked up here to this part of the creek, they all kind of started to move off down the creek. So what I did was after I rigged up that shrimp, I actually sat on the bank for probably like five, 10 minutes and just stayed completely quiet. And they started rolling closer and closer and closer until they got comfortable with me. And then as soon as they started rolling close enough, popped that cast in and it was like instantaneous. I mean, you saw, I literally, as soon as it landed, I popped it twice and it was on. But that was beautiful. So we're going to keep going and see if we can find another one. Yeah, so I actually spotted some more. I just saw a couple rollers way down the creek there. Um, I just broke off of this pod that was right here in front of me. So I'm going to come walk way around these bushes so I don't walk near the water and spook them and get over there. I just heard a big one feed back here, but I'm gonna walk around and so I don't spook him and get away from the water and come back over. Hopefully meet him right there and hopefully get one. All right, you guys are walking right up here to where these tarpon were. Oh, perfect. Nice, nice, I felt that little hit, nice. I felt him just tap it and he came right back forward and hit it. Nice, 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 nice. Hell yeah, okay, I gotta be careful because there's a crocodile pretty close by. Oh, nice, oh, that was epic. I literally felt that little hit, saw boil, I knew there was one behind it, so I popped it one more time and he came back and thumped it. Oh, beautiful. 
beautiful little fish right there. Check him out. Absolutely clobbered that 3X shrimp right there, guys. Oh, nice. Oh, he's gorgeous. On this light tackle, guys, I'm using a medium light um, Ducket Salt Series and 2500 Florida Fishing Products Osprey CE. It's the perfect little setup for these backcountry tarpon. Oh, man, he scarfed that thing. He got hooked perfect. Whoop. Guys, check out. Man, a healthy little tarpon. Look at how he ate that bait. Look at how he ate that. Guys, check that out. I think he wanted the shrimp. Oh my gosh, he scarfed it. Look at that. Holy crud, man. That's a beautiful little tarpon right there, guys. Florida Keys, it's exactly what we're after today. And the mission was a success, we found him. Beautiful little baby tarpon out here. Gorgeous, switched up to that shrimp presentation, some lighter leader, and that's all it took. We're on him now. Found out the pattern. He got hooked like right in the freaking cheekbone. There we go, got the hook out. Beautiful. Monster 3X shrimp is out. Woo! And he took off. <laughs> it's gonna get a nice little release up close, but he wasn't having it. He was ready to go back. Beautiful little fish. All right. Well, this little section of the creek did good for us. We're gonna move down and see if we can find any more. And uh, we'll get right back to you when we get back to that next section. And check this out, you guys. The Monster 3X, after catching two baby tarpon that jumped like maniacs, is still perfect shape. When you see their slogan, guys, they're not kidding. It's one bait, fish after fish, and this thing does not come off. This is what we do to catch freaking tarpon. When you're in the Florida Keys and you don't want to go on the boat, this is probably the best thing you can do to catch tarpon. It sucks a little bit, but if you can make it through, you make it to some good spots. Well, you guys didn't have my GoPro on, but I just lost one. <laughs> didn't get a good enough hook set in him. And he jumped and spit it. It was about the same size as the ones I've just caught. Not, not really too much bigger. Dang it, I was hoping that one would stay on. He crushed it too. There's another one. That's a bigger one. That's a bigger one. All right, so it's not a big one, but it's definitely the nicest one so far. I think there's a few fish in this hole right here too. Yeah, it's maybe like a pound bigger than, than the first one we caught. Maybe it's about the same size. He just fought so hard right in the beginning. Oh, he's beautiful. I think he might have gotten hooked well, but I don't know. Couldn't see, but I definitely jammed that hook in him when he ate. Try to keep quiet to maybe not spook the other ones that are probably in there. That shrimp presentation, man. Oh, he took off. That shrimp presentation was killer. That's just exactly what they want. I'm using 20 pound guys, 20 pound a liter, fluorocarbon, really light stuff. Oh, he's beautiful. He's not even that big. He's just super fat. That's why, he, that's why he, he has so much spunk. Beautiful fish, man. Beautiful. Wow, look at that. Man, what a freaking run. It's gorgeous. Oh my God, I think there's actually another one right behind him. I'm pretty sure I just saw another tarpon right behind this guy. As soon as I tightened up that drag, he got so angry. Wow, gorgeous, man. Wow. All right, together, there it is. It's a beautiful, super healthy tarpon in the Florida Keys, man. It's exactly what we came out here for today. Beautiful fish, man. January, got about 69 degree water temps. Look at that. Isn't that just pretty? Gonna revive him until he's ready to go. Whew, there he goes. <laughs> they always do that, man. Those little guys are so spunky. They just take off. Oh man, that was gorgeous. It's exactly what we were looking for out here, guys. Beautiful baby tarpon right there. Look at that, guys. That was the fourth tarpon I've hooked today and our 3X is still in perfect condition. So uh, yeah, all you gotta do is tie it up, re-rig it, and get back in there. So that's exactly what we're gonna do. Oh, 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 look at all the tarpon. That was like three of them right here. Hope you guys enjoyed that video. 
stay tuned. We got a lot more great content coming up. Hopefully gonna get another full length video out this week. The winter fishing has been amazing. So stay tuned guys, next video is gonna be freaking sick. I got a great idea coming up. See you guys later.